All right, so part two. I got everything is unassembled from the boxes, and um, it's come, it comes with two 275 ounce motors. But I'm putting 425 uh, ounce in there. I'm going to swap them out because I still have my other machine here, which these are 425s. So I'm going to swap those out and use those on this one since it's a heavier heavier duty machine. Um, but everything comes numbered in the boxes too. 8, 13, 16. This looks like the power supply wire to run everything. Um, just some of the plates. Three and a half inch spindle mount so I can stop using the shitty Bosch Colt that I had bad luck with. Bearings kept going bad. Uh, drivers and uh, precision couplings um, and some bearings. It's called a hardware pack number 20 through 18. Also, the bearings still got the motor mount on there too. So, but uh, part two, this is everything, and the Z-axis is also 20 millimeter ball screw, 25 millimeter uh, rail and carriages on on the Z-axis too, with uh, I think four and a half travel space. Um, that's plenty what I need. So, that's all the parts unassembled now so far.